Hello and welcome to Ask an Entertainment Lawyer. I'm Larry Zerner. I'm an entertainment lawyer in Los Angeles, California. I've been a lawyer for 27 years and I'm here to answer your questions. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe below. And if you have uh, questions that you want answered on future episodes, just leave it in the comments. Uh, if you need more information about me, you can find it at zernerlaw.com. You can email me at larry at zernerlaw.com. And one last thing, remember, just because I'm giving legal advice doesn't mean I'm your lawyer right now. Uh, if you want to uh, start a legal relationship, you have to uh, call me. Okay, let's get started on our first uh, question, which is, um, is there such a thing as the poor man's copyright? That's a question I get a lot, which is, um, you know, can I just e uh, mail myself a copy of the script and that will pr provide proof that I own the script? Okay, the short answer to that is no. There is no such thing as the poor man's copyright. There is never been a case where someone has proved um, ownership of a script because they have a post, they have an envelope and it's dated from five years ago. Uh, just doesn't work that way. Um, that being said, uh, and I've covered in other uh, episodes uh, why it's important to register your script with the Copyright Office or anything you might you think might get stolen of that's creative. But um, are there ways to prove that you um, uh, wrote something earlier uh, other than e mailing it to yourself? Yeah, there are lots of ways. Um, one way is uh, witnesses. So if other people have read your script, uh, or you've given your script to those people, they can they can testify that yes, I have this script and um, Johnny sent it to me uh, five years ago. So that's evidence that it was existed. You can also uh, email it to yourself. I would I would recommend using a service like Gmail or Yahoo Mail that you know will be around. Um, and then if anyone ever questions when did the script arrive, you can always pull up that email and there's the attachment with your script and that's evidence um, uh, that of that the script uh, exists at a certain time so there's no such thing as the poor man's copyright I don't recommend the poor man's copyright but there are ways to prove you uh, that your script existed at a certain period of time by emailing it to yourself or sending it to other people uh, so that's the quick answer um, Thanks for watching. Take care.